सो हाय दिस इज डॉक्टर जूहुल पटेल विश इज फ्रॉम पटेल्स मिनिमल एक्सेस गैनकोलॉजी सो दिस पेशेंट केम विद कंप्लेन्स ऑफ लोअर एबडोमिनल पेन सिंस ऑलमोस्ट फोर टू फाइव मंथ्स ऑन सोनोग्राफी दे रिपोर्टेड ओवेरियन सिस्ट अब आफ्टर गोइंग इन साइड वॉट वी सॉ दिस सिग्मॉइड इज डेंसली अदरेंट टू लैटरल पेल्विक वॉल सो आई केम विद माई ग्रास पर ट्राइंग टू सेपरेट एंड ट्राइंग टू सी वेदर द अदेशंस आर डेंस अदेशंस but what i can see is there are there are some hyperemic areas on the lateral pelvic wall so yes that's what i was expecting so in this type of situations i would always advise never be very harsh to the tissue trying to separate as far as you can so we were not able to get the plane that side so we moved this side and at this type of situation i always feel that the best instrument to do the additions will be any sturdy instrument now best instrument on the tls trolley that is sturdy is nothing but a suction so we came up with a suction trying to gently sweep off the sigmoid colon how much ever we can again advice would be never be too harsh because tissue will be very friable so if you give extra traction there is a chance you might tear off the tissue which is at the end in this case it is sigmoid so gently swipe it across gently suck out whatever fluid is coming out you can see the right side tube is also heavily inflamed okay the bladder is also heavily inflamed coming back to our location again trying to separate by giving traction with my left hand okay i've switched the uh, instruments traction is coming from right and the same thing with traction swiping with the suction solves most of the problem as you can see now the entire tissue is very hard yes after restoring the normal anatomy now we are proceeding with the tlh so coming up with my shearer sealing at three different locations cutting in between reaching to the isthmus area now chopping off the uv fold you can see hyperemic spots and free uv fold also was very thick as you can appreciate in the video all this pushing everything should be not very harsh okay we should not be very pushy bladder is not going swiftly come and see where bladder bladder is adhered in the vasico vaginal space i always prefer sharp dissection more than blunt dissection sucking out all the blood repeating the same steps but as tissue was very much inflamed the tissues water content is more that's why the picture is more foggy because more wet vapors are coming right reaching to the isthmus now taking care of the uterines okay, because tissue was very much inflamed you can see the picture is foggy going ahead with the colpotomy unipolar is my favorite instrument to do the colpotomy because it is fastest but as i always tell unipolar doesn't have that much sealing capacity 
So whenever you see a user, come with the bipolar. Okay, this is the site where it was other. Just checking the integrity. What I can find is it was enter misentered border. So most probably nothing. Just to always this type of cases whenever you think that there was bowel additions or there was some dissection between uh, our tissue of interest and bowel. Okay, always in those type of cases I always advise put some drain. So even if any thermal injury it will come after 48 hours at that time your drain will pick up so you won't be constantly worried here as the tissue was very friable I am suturing it with barbed suture you can see so much hyperemic areas right, this is the final picture checking the site we are pouring the water and look for the bubbles I can see there was no bubbles coming that means the sigmoid integrity was intact thank you